Jarvis, please introduce yourself. My name is Jarvis. Jeremy is a Stooge Residential Virtual Intelligence System. I can help with a variety of tasks including setting alarms, controlling the lights, playing music, and more. I can give my phone a quick shake to turn the lamp on or off. On, off. I can also speak to it. Turn the lamp on. Home automation was, was very appealing to me because it's something that's very difficult to make a one-size-fits-all solution that's commercially available, right? Everyone's homes are dramatically different. Their routines are different. How they use their homes are different. There's not really anything you can get that meets all the needs I want. So it was, a, it was an easy choice for me to be something fun to work on because I knew I could make something kind of unique. My name's Jeremy Blum. I'm an electrical engineer by profession, but when I'm not officially doing electrical engineering, I find myself hacking and making and tinkering. I picked the name before what the acronym stood for. Uh, it's definitely inspired by Tony Stark and Iron Man. What does that look like to you, Jarvis? Not unlike an atom, in which case the nucleus would be here. One day I'd like to have it at that level. It's nowhere near there yet, but I'm learning a lot along the way. Please set my desk light strip to orange at 60% brightness. I think it's been pretty clear my entire life that I would be making something. Uh, I've been building things since I was little. I grew up doing a bunch of woodworking that eventually transitioned to building computers and then building the pieces inside of the computer and designing like electronics and learning software and um, doing mechanical design and, and things like that. What I'm working on right now, and it's not done yet, is basically there's some rope tied around the shades. There's a pulley over on the left side here. And then there's a laser cut and 3D printed assembly over here. Eventually I'll have this wired into the system, but I, I don't have it wired up yet. But um, basically when you want to open the blinds, you'll say open the blinds or open the shades. And this guy will spin and pull them open like so. People like to make stuff. When that thing purrs to life for the first time, well, it never really purrs to life the first time. The first time it breaks horribly. And then maybe the second or third time you work out all the bugs and you actually get it to turn on. Um, that second or third time when it actually turns on is very exciting. I can also talk to it over chat instant messaging kind of interface. There's lots of buttons and dials and switches that I can use to control it physically or lots of things in the system will happen automatically like turning the lights on when I wake up or turning the screen on when I enter the room, things like that. Ultimately, I just want a system where I don't have to think about it anymore. It just works so seamlessly and it's so integrated into my home that I don't have to see it, I don't have to think about it, it just knows what I want and it does what I want it to and it's unobtrusive but, but useful and functional. Good night Jarvis.